Hi, this is Greg from ASUS, and in this video, I want to take you through some of the audio features of our latest gaming motherboards and laptops, and the integrated software that you can use to get the most out of your gaming experience. So the first thing you notice when you open up the Sonic Studio software is that there's three tabs across the top. We're going to talk about the first one here first, Sonic Studio. And there's two modes, basic mode and advanced mode. We'll go through the basic mode first. And uh, on the top here, it shows you what audio device you're using. And you can go ahead and adjust the volume uh, up and down right there. Um, there's also an equalizer setting. So right now it's on none, but you can select through a few preset equalizer settings. Or you can go to custom, click this button here. And you can do a custom EQ setting for however you like it. So yeah, we'll just kind of do that. You can also reset it back to zero. Hit OK. Now below that we have our Sonic Studio effects. You can turn those off and on globally right here. And uh, this is just kind of, there's some presets made for music, movies, gaming, communication. So you can select one of these and uh, you can also adjust some of the settings down here below for each one of these presets. Uh, smart volume, that adjusts the volume automatically. So uh, it, things that are quiet in whatever movie you're watching or game you're playing are a little louder. And things that are loud are a little bit lower. You can also change the strength of this. Below that we have voice clarity. Now, this is kind of a boost for the uh, vocal range of the spectrum. So if you're watching a movie with a lot of dialogue or just like a game and you really want to be able to hear what the other characters are saying, you can turn this on uh, to boost the voice clarity. Uh, bass boost, pretty self-explanatory. It boosts the, the bass levels. Treble boost, same thing but for treble. And then there's reverb, and this will add kind of almost a slight echo to, to the audio uh, with a few different presets for, uh, to make it sound like you're in different types of spaces. And uh, this one, I usually, I find it's better on low. Once you get too high, it seems a little too extreme for me, uh, but uh, you, know, you can definitely play around with that and find a setting you like. Now below that is the surround setting. And uh, this setting, basically, if you, if you turn this on, let's say you're listening to a game or watching a movie with just headphones. If you turn this on, then it will create a virtual surround using just the two speakers. So even if you don't have a full surround sound setup, you can still get virtual surround with your headset or just a two-speaker setup. And of course, like we just went through and customized the movie setting. If you go into gaming, you can create a different setting for gaming and adjust that. It has a lot of the same settings. Uh, and then communication it only has a few settings, um, smart volume and uh, voice clarity. And it also has a different one, ambient noise reduction, uh, which will help to reduce ambient noise, uh, any background noise, things like that. So that is the end of part one for this Sonic Studio overview. Go ahead and check out part two where we go over advanced mode.